Hello everyone and welcome. So today I've got a kind of new mod to introduce. Yeah, it, it's a new mod. It's an add-on for Silence Gems, an official add-on. So it is called uh, Silence Gems Extra Parts. Right here. And what this does is it adds additional tool parts in. <laughs> Nothing else really. So currently the selection is not big. It adds a variety of metals for the most part. So let's go ahead and maximize this window. And currently I've got all the metals from Fun Ores and since Fun Ores is designed to be Compatible with a variety of other mods. Uh, these are all fairly common metals. So we've got things like copper, tin, silver, lead, and so on and so forth. And then we've also got uh, Enderium, which is in a, a couple of different mods. And then we got the Prismarinium from Fun Ores, which I don't think is used in any other mod whatsoever. But uh, yeah, it's a, it's a thing. So, the only item that this mod adds at the moment are these ingots, and these are just kind of a, a little safety mechanism for adding the parts in. It's best if there's a single item that the part is tied to. It can be crafted with anything that's in the ore dictionary under the same name, so ingot copper in this case. In any kind of copper will work if you want to make a copper pickaxe, so I can take the fun ores copper and uh, just use the iron rods for safety's sake and that'll make a, a copper pickaxe uh, not not a very good pickaxe but it's a pickaxe and of course we can make any kind of tools out of it sword axe so on uh, would not be able to make a copper katana because those are super tier only. If I did prismarinium, for instance, so that would work. We can make a prismarinium katana. Uh, Enderium, I believe, is also super tier. Uh, yes, it is. So I've also added to the tooltips what tier the material is to assist in making tools. If you don't know, flint is the only mundane tier tool or tool material normally. Uh, it's uh, I've been working on this for 10 hours, so if I'm not making sense, that may be why. Regular gems are regular, and then supercharged gems are super. So those are the three tiers. As for tool rods, rods support more than one tier quite often. So, for example, bonus sticks support any mundane or regular materials. Iron supports anything, and then the ornate rods support super only. And uh, that's one reason I've been using the iron rods a lot, because they support anything. I don't, uh, say, accidentally try to <laughs> do something like this. That does not work. So one thing that's kind of nice about the way this mod turned out is uh, I've not actually made new textures for each tool part. I'm actually just using the opal texture and coloring them. So basically just starting with white and coloring them. And that's nice in that I don't have to make uh, any textures really. I, <laughs> I love that zombie that just came out of nowhere over there. Uh, but also kind of bad because there's not as much control over it as if you were making the individual textures. So some of them can't really be made to look as great as I would like, but they're good enough, I would say. Oh, and if you're wondering about this armor, this is from Ebon Arts. This is not something I, I made. It's just a... A little mod I've been playing around with recently.
So that's all there is to say about this, I guess. How long have I been recording? Less than five minutes? <laughs> Tiny little mod. But uh, it, it does what it's supposed to do. So this is a nice little proof of concept for adding parts from another mod. This is something that I designed GEMS 2.0 to be able to do from the very beginning. So it would be possible for someone else to make an add-on for Silence GEMS and add materials or maybe add in the ability to have tool parts into an existing mod or something like that. I don't expect anyone to do that. But that's something that can be done, and uh, if anyone out there is trying to figure out how to do that, looking at the uh, extra parts code on GitHub would probably be the best way to do that. So I guess that's about all there is to say here. So I've got more, more tool materials to play around with, can do something crazy like that. Uh, I, I don't know how good that is. Maybe that. I don't know. <laughs> Neither of these look very good. But I'm going to go ahead and shut up and maybe go play a game for a bit because I've spent all day working on this. I think I could use a break. So thanks for watching. Uh, let me know if you have any suggestions of what kind of materials I should add. And yeah, I guess that's... Uh... That's about it. If you have any materials that you think should be added into the mod, go ahead and let me know down in the comments or wherever, and I will seriously consider that. So again, thanks for watching. I'll see you on whatever I do next. Uh, probably some random video in two weeks or something going by my current pattern.